In this video, we're going to take a look at the demo site that we're building, both the start point and the end point, and kind of compare and contrast. So we're going to start out by importing this Drupal site. It's for a fake band called Cash Bacon, and it's pretty basic. We have a news page with a few posts on it, a bio, which is a static page, a shows page, which is also static, just has filler content on it right now, and a records page, which is an alias to a taxonomy listing. So each of these is a piece of content that has a certain tag and is therefore showing up on this page. And it has a URL alias that's records instead of its real path, which is taxonomy slash term slash, I believe, nine. And we have this one item in the sidebar. So this is our starting point. And in this course, we're going to be working through some site building techniques and going through a lot of contributed Drupal modules that can help you enhance the functionality of your website. The end result will be something rather different. This is that final site that we'll be working toward. First of all, we have a custom home page, the whole bunch of stuff on it. A feed from Twitter, another feed from Facebook, a poll. Here's that SoundCloud widget again an upcoming shows block that links to a full shows page. We have a dedicated news section. It's just using filler content for now, but you can see of quite a few articles and a custom display. We have some filters, some different filters over here. The bio page is basically the same. The records page is presented differently. We have a shows page that actually has shows on it. And we can view upcoming past shows and even view our shows as a calendar. We also have a custom contact form. And the sidebar has some more stuff going on as well. So as you can see, there's a lot more functionality built into this website. And over the course of these lessons, you're going to learn how to do all of this. So that's an overview of where we're going to start and where we're going to end up.